The Bible warns us about sin, about the heart. It says the heart is more deceitful than all else, is desperately sick. Who can understand it? In each of our hearts is the same seed that caused a man like David to sin. You may say, I'll never do stuff like that. Then you're one step closer. Why? We should never treat sin lightly. I'll stand before you and confess. I've never slept with another woman, but I have committed adultery because the Bible said if a person looks lustfully on another person, they have committed adultery. Do you see how dangerous sin is? It's the small seeds. In fact, the smaller the sin, sometimes the more dangerous it is. Why? You won't go out and kill someone today, but you might shout at your wife to die. And that, the Bible says, is like murder, right? When you anger. You may not go out and steal from a bank, but you'll steal from your company tomorrow when you don't use your time well. And these seeds can grow. Do you know where the fourth or fifth tallest tree in the world is? It's in San Francisco, Agusan del Sur. Uh -huh. And in that San Francisco, there is a tree that is 300 feet tall. It is a Philippine rosewood. A tree that tall still starts from seeds this small. That's, that's sin for you. The smallest seed can bloom to the biggest evil. And so be very careful, please. Some of you, there's no joy in following the Lord. And you're like, I'm not doing anything bad. But there are small sins that eat at your joy. Little things, little self-idolatry that you don't notice. And that's, that's a challenge for all of us. So I want you guys to see sin, no one is exempt. exempt. James 1.15 says, when lust has conceived, it gives birth to sin. When sin is accomplished, it brings forth death. This is in that verse that says God is a good God, remember, in James 1.17. But James 1.15 is telling us, don't be deceived. It is not God that causes sin. It is our hearts, that desire in our hearts for something because we are broken. So be very careful. Don't think, I'm not capable of that. Whisper to yourself, be very careful with sin. Please, don't ever treat it lightly.